Certainly a lot happening as we start the news at four and we begin with a massive warehouse fire in Atala. This is going on right now and it has been so for some 24 hours. I'm Christopher Sign. And I'm Brenda Ladon in for Pam Huff tonight. ABC 3340 has crews on the scene as firefighters work to battle the blaze. First, we go to Brian, Byron Khalil. Byron, firefighters expect this battle to continue for at least a couple more days. They do. It's looking like that will be the case. Just take a look behind me. This is still a very active scene here. Firefighters still working to put out these flames. In the meantime, they're asking people to avoid this area. This is near Highway 77 and 11. Fire trucks are moving water back and forth. As of right now, the cause of this fire is still under investigation. It started around noon on Monday. The firefighters have been working the scene nonstop since. First responders from at least 10 surrounding counties and multiple state agencies have helped out in some capacity, but firefighters say they still have a big hurdle ahead of them. The outer portions of the building is pretty well contained at this point. Our problem is the center of the building is still burning. Uh, we can't get water to that area right now. The roof is partially collapsed on that. So we're trying to keep the outward areas cool so we don't have too large of a smoke plume. That was Byron Khalil starting our live team coverage and firefighters go on to say there are large bales of paper in the center of that particular building with the roof now collapsed. All of those factors contributing to this ongoing blaze. And of course, Byron Khalil will be joining us again at five and six.